The correct body position allows you to become more streamlined, improving your efficiency in the water. Keep your head in a neutral face-down position, directing your eyes 90 degrees below you to the bottom of the pool. This will help straighten your body while positioning it high in the water. Flatten your back and keep your body as flat as possible. Maintain a face-down head position, keeping your head still at all times unless lifting it to breathe. A center snorkel can be used to help you feel comfortable with the neutral face-down position in the water. A good breathing technique delivers oxygen to your muscles and helps you to swim more comfortably and efficiently. As your arms begin to pull down through the stroke, lift your head out of the water to breathe. To maintain an efficient body position, aim to keep your chin as close to the waterline as possible. After your hands finish the pull phase and begin to leave the water for the recovery phase, drop your head back down into the neutral face down position. This will allow your arms to recover over the surface of the water back to the front of the stroke. Try using fins to help support your body and keep it positioned high in the water. The stronger your kick technique, the more propulsion you will achieve and the faster you'll be able to swim as a result. Start the dolphin kick by driving from your hips, kicking down through the water until your legs reach full extension. In this powerful movement, the legs should accelerate on the down kick towards the bottom of the pool with the ankles flicking at the end. On the up kick, the kick upwards towards the pool's surface, relax your legs, bringing your heels towards the surface of the water to create a slight bend in the leg at the knee. Fins can be used to help strengthen your legs, enabling you to generate more power and to kick harder. Learn how to improve your stroke technique for a faster, more efficient swim. With your arms in the water and elbows positioned high, begin the arm pull by pressing down with your forearms to catch and pull back the water. Holding the water, maintain a high elbow position and accelerate your arms through the water, pointing your fingers towards the bottom of the pool. As you pull, aim to keep your hands inside your body line. Push backwards with your hands as you move into the back of the stroke, accelerating your hands up and out of the water into the recovery phase. In a relaxed motion, bring your arms over the surface of the water keeping them straight and close to the waterline until they re-enter the pool at the front of the stroke. Finger paddles can be used to help you focus on improving the positioning of your hands.